I'm out south of Saddle Peak and we came out here today to look at a natural avalanche that happened a couple nights ago on the face behind me between the main summits of Saddle. It was about six to eight inches deep and it broke a thousand feet wide and it was a very hard slab sitting on a thin layer of facets over a hard bed surface that all allowed it to propagate wide. As we came along the ridge here, we were kicking off small sloughs of the one to two inches of low density snow that fell and that wasn't propagating out wide. It was able to run pretty far on those facets. And then in our pit over here, we don't have much of a slab over those facets and they're not propagating unstable test scores. So it's low danger right now. We're only expecting small avalanches or isolated instabilities, but we do want to dig for this layer and check it, check for it before we ride in steep terrain and keep it in mind for when we do get more snow, we'll definitely see avalanches break on it.